little gift to show my gratitude for all our work together. Thanks. Who's this guy? Look at those guys, huh? Mm. They had some times, <laughs> huh? <laughs> yeah, lots of that. I just wish my mother could have seen it. Whoever she is, I'm sure she's proud. I think I know exactly where she is, and it's pretty fucking hot. <laughs> you had one of those too, huh? Gentlemen, is everything okay here? Yeah. Did he memorize their license plate? Oh my god. Was this man with him? Yeah. I saw him. He's heard enough, huh? Mm hmm. <laughs> Going to arrest him right now. <laughs> the way I remember, he said, uh, that's why you got the top tier positions. I need a signature. Who is this guy? He almost looks like one of the guys who hang around Tony. New hats. Mike's right in the button. Messer owns a huge asset. Couple in what? Three-year-old airline tickets. Wait, so that one guy is just another red? How many fucking reds are there? Oh, that's terrible. Where's he gonna be laid out? Oh no, God damn it. <laughs> well, let us know. Don't worry, you will survive them all. Probably won't remember who you are, but you will be the last man standing. You're fundamental love to all of us. And not just financially either. So, the Johnny Cannon? <laughs> he looks kind of happy. <laughs> Lorraine, you're looking good. Yeah, keeping it together with Pilates and gin. Lady Shylock, you got some reputation. Yeah, my mother said that might happen. Lady Shylock? What? She has a reputation? I never even heard of her. Jesus leans off the cross and whispers to Peter, I can see your house from here. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's having a great time at Daddy's funeral. <laughs> Who's taking over now? The idiot or Johnny? I saw a huge mushroom cloud. Band of Brothers. <sighs> but I told him, hey asshole, I'm the one taking all the fucking risk here. I have to fake the invoices. Sometimes you gotta just take care of yourself, you know? Sure you do, honey. Tell me more about those invoices. Oh, look at us. 15 fucking years. The language. <laughs> I'd say, I haven't changed a bit, right? <laughs> say provolone. Uh. I didn't say it. Right. Guys, this is your uncle, Tony Blundetta. How come we never met you before? Mm -hmm. I've been away on business. <laughs> I've never even heard of you. <laughs> Me neither. But he exists. This is Meadow. God, you turn out beautiful, honey. Uh -huh. Careful. See with my family now, uh, you know, separation. You gotta make an appointment. See each other. All right. <laughs> Tony's been away. It's been hard, but he's back now. For good. Take that. Very touched by that funeral the other day. Real hot grabber. That fucking little carmine. And after what? Five years in Florida fixing wet t-shirt contests. What kind of restroom is that? You have to shit? Just in the open? Not even a door? Mm, boy, are you fat! <laughs> 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 I've been away from all this a long time. If I got a shot at staying out and putting shit together, I should take it. Is he serious? <laughs> How's that supposed to work out? Number one on the American Film Institute's Greatest American Movies list. 
Citizen Kate. Jesus, it's black and white. <laughs> broke all the rules and invented some new ones. The cinematography, music, and Oscar-winning screenplay by Wells and Herman J. something. <laughs> I give you ten minutes before you turn it off. Man, they made it through. There was the cinematography. Yeah, that was very good. <laughs> Movie experts right here. <laughs> the cup at least and the lift. She said she was remodeling her upstairs, but I had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> and it's already forgotten. The entire movie. <laughs> Just so pretentious. Ooh, we're watching Citizen Kane. It's supposed to be a masterpiece. Great cinematography. Broke the rules. Invented new ones. Mm -hmm. That silence afterwards. <laughs> Janice, you're a newlywed. Six months and Bobby still hasn't found my rosebud. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you should hire a reporter. Movie night was fun, though. Who's there at the uh, Tony Blandetto homecoming? God, is that all you think about is your fucking work? Excuse me, you're not friends. While we were trying to get pregnant, he climbed right over me to become an assistant supervisor in the Milton Task Force. Moved to Los Angeles and jumped a pay grade without me. So, where were we? Movie night. Rosebud. Cinematography. Snitching on people. For what? Maybe take some comfort in the fact that you're trying to do the right thing by helping your government. Oh, seriously. <laughs> Stop joking, please. Want to do me in? Absolutely. Stakes might be a little high for you. You know you can't pay us in napkins. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna deal those? They're not candy bars. You can let some of them go. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> hey, hey, you gotta try this. I'm gone for one hour, all of a sudden it turns into a fucking slumber party. Somebody woke up on the wrong side of the bed. None of your fucking business. Which side of the bed I wake up on? You don't make fun of me. Got it? Got it. <laughs> he didn't even blink. <laughs> <laughs> fucking sliding a stupid bill in and out of the cigarette machine for like an hour. I bet you can go longer than that. Mm. Why do you always talk like a whore? Because men like it. I think you're right about that. Dude, in front of Adriana, what the fuck? Went to collect for my cop up there. His buddy on the force saw some car out by Napoleon's diner a couple of weeks ago. He ran the plate, and it bounced back a no hit. Feds. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Mr. Hat Boy is going to die. Feel him out a little bit. I gotta do it. I know the guy. I know the way he thinks. I know the way he acts. Well, apparently not. Or you would have noticed something. I mean, that head looked very suspicious. I almost even said back then that it looks like he's hiding something under it. <laughs> I just wanted to thank you for taking the components out of the home theater. I bought that for us to watch movies as a family, okay? Not that to take your girlfriends. <laughs> I talked to my lawyer about filing a separation agreement. We should be able to settle this thing like adults. Then stop taking shit out of the house! It's his house, though. It's... What is she doing for money, actually? She's always just at home. You weren't followed here, were you? No, I, I, I don't think so. I'm, 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 I'm pretty careful. Everything else okay? Good EKG and shit, huh? <laughs> 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 that was very subtle. <laughs> Checking for mics. <laughs> Tap his head. Relax. It's not about losing no. your hair over. Close. Even if it kills Tony, I will have that system back for next time. Mm. So what is next on that list? Number three, The Godfather. Mm. <laughs> is that picture actually trying to tell us that there are three rats? The head boy, Adriana, and someone else? <laughs> What's the matter? <laughs> I'm a rat. Oh, I want to tell you all something. This is driving me crazy. Oh, you know, you can tell us anything. 
Don't do it. Where are you going? <laughs> oh, oh, my fuck. God. oh, you're for Tony. Because they couldn't watch a movie. <laughs> <laughs> Had boys no more. Only two rats left. We gotta talk about my compensation overall. Interferon for my son's MS? That's 20 a year, man. Right. Fucking knew it. I knew that guy looked like him. So he's the third rat. How did they get to that guy? It's completely out of the blue. I don't even know what he's doing. Tina Francesco's her name. She makes up vendors, but she writes some real checks. Then her father cashes them. Tina Francesco. <laughs> the father's name's Victor. <laughs> Spell it. Sons imports.